happy video day guys. So for today's video, we're gonna be doing my first ever Ipsy bag, not Ipsy bag, this is Ipsy Plus box unboxing. Um, I didn't order and I have never ordered the Ipsy bags just because I personally don't like samples and I also don't want too many bags. <laughs> I, I saw now that you're able to order the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus even if you're not already an Ipsy bag member. So I said, okay. So I signed up for the subscription of this. So I'm going to be getting Ipsy Glam Bag Plus every single month from now on for a while. Let's see how it goes. Let's see if it's any good. So this is going to be my first unboxing of the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. I'm super excited. Like you guys know, I am subscribed to BoxyCharm and I've been getting BoxyCharm for I want to say two years or close to two years and I've been really happy with BoxyCharm. So in this video, I'm going to show you guys all the products that I'm getting and then we'll compare it to how it did compare to BoxyCharm because BoxyCharm is my tried and true. It's been pretty good. It's given me good products. I've been really happy with it. So let's compare the two. If you guys are interested in seeing what I got in my box, let's get right into the video. So before we jump into this box, I'm going to give you guys a quick introduction. I'm Christina Brooke. This is the Glam Ranch. What I do is I talk about makeup from my little ranch. So if you guys like makeup, hit that subscribe button. And also I have a huge giveaway going on right now for back to school. If you guys want to be part of it, all that information is down in the description box. Let's not waste any more time. We're going to jump right into this box. I'm going to show you guys everything I got in the box. I'm probably not going to try on too many of the items just because I already have makeup on and some of the items I did already try on my eyes because I knew it was coming in this box because it was an add on, but we're going to get to that right now. So let's get into it. Let me show you guys everything I got. So ha 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 ha. This is very reminiscent of BoxyCharm. It comes in like this type of box and then it has like this foam, you know, so that it doesn't get ruined. Um, maybe a little bit better quality boxing than BoxyCharm, but who cares about that? I actually like this little pamphlet that it comes with. It says, um, July 2019. This is July box. It's like a summer themed box. So we have a bunch of summer-esque type of stuff in here. So uh, yeah, it tells you everything that you got in the box. This is like the same as BoxyCharm. Um, this one gives you more information and I think is a little bit better done. So before I started with Ipsy, they had me fill out like this customization type of thing so that they can kind of like pick products geared towards me. I was really excited for that. I did like that a lot. And what I also liked about Ipsy is there was variations in this box and they allowed you to do add-ons which I don't see in BoxyCharm, at least not yet, that if you wanted like a different colorway or something like that, you can add it on for a cheaper price. And I thought that was pretty cool. Never seen that before. And I really love that. So I'm going to show you the item that I did add on. So in my box, I got this and this got me so excited. I got the Huda Beauty Smoky Obsessions palette. These are her mini palettes and the value of these, I think are $28. Let me just double check. The value of these are $27. So they're $27. These are beautiful. I own the Smoky Obsessions palette. I love this palette. I was not that bummed when I saw that this is what I was getting. Um, this is what it looks like in the inside so you guys can see it's so beautiful. You were able to add on a different colorway if you wanted to for $12 more. And since these are 27, it's like half the price. So what I did was I added on this one. This is the Huda Beauty Mauve Obsessions. So I actually was able to get the Mauve Obsessions one, which is what I have on my eyes right now. And I was able to get this one and literally I didn't have to pay the full price for it. I paid half the price and I got two of them, which I thought was really, really cool. I love that. Now, this is going to go in a giveaway. So either way, that's great because I was able to get a really cool product for you guys for a future giveaway. So I am going to put this one aside for a giveaway. I'll put it in my giveaway bin. If you guys saw it, you guys would be super excited. But I'm going to put it in my giveaway bin because I did get this one for me. So I did pay $12 extra just to add this one on. But I didn't care because I was super excited to pay half price. So this was a huge win for me. I loved that Huda Beauty was in this box. It got me so excited. So what you pay is $25 a month for this box. And that's 27 And that was such a good product that you basically paid the box. I did a $12 add-on, but I paid half price for that. So to me, that was just a win-win. So I really loved, I love that Huda Beauty is in here. That got me so excited. So the next item that was inside of this box is also a great item. 
I own it already, but that's okay because I can put it into a giveaway. It's this one right here from It Cosmetics. This is a superhero mascara. This is also a really good product. A lot of people love it. I actually got it in my BoxyCharm a few months back, I feel, and I've been using it. And I do like it. I think it's a great mascara. Um, the mascara is $24 and it's a great value. It's a beautiful mascara. I'm going to be able to include this one also in a giveaway, so that is fine that I already own it. So yeah, this is also a really good product. So the next thing that we got is this right here. So this is from the company Pure Lease. It's a watermelon and energizing aqua balm. So it's like a balm moisturizer for your face. I'll show you guys what it looks like. It's actually really cute. It comes in this really cute squeezy tube and I just thought this was really cute. I love that it's watermelon infused and it's lightweight oil free gel cream. This looks like another really good product. It retails for this one retails for $45, so that's a really nice value right there. So it says here that it's supposed to moisturize the skin. Aloe helps to reduce inflammation, and it also has cucumbers to firm the skin. This looks like another really cool product. I was really excited for it. I love the packaging of it. I'm a packaging, like, like I see packaging. Sometimes I'm like, oh my god, that's so cool. But anyways, that was one that I really liked. But then I saw this and I was like, I really like this too. So this is from Pixie. So this is their Skin Treats. This is their Glow Mist. Now I wanted this. I have not gotten this product. I have their Milky Mist and I really like their Milky Mist, but I really, really, really wanted their Glow Mist because I, if you guys don't know, love Lumi Skin. To me, Lumi Skin is where it's at. I like to look luminous, young, and youthful. So anything Lumi gets me super excited. So this costs, how much is this one? This is a $15 value and I love Pixie. I'm actually gonna spray this one right now because for sure I'm gonna keep this because I, I love Lumi sprays. So I can't wait to try this. Let's see how it works. I already have so much Lumi on my face that it's gonna be like, ooh. I almost feel like it smells like cucumbers. That's interesting. I really like that. So it's supposed to be, um, it has argan oil in it. Now the Milky Mist has a really strong fragrance to it and this one doesn't. This one almost feels like it has like a nourishing smell to it, almost like a cucumber or something. I really like that. And the glow, I feel like I'm glowing. I was glowing before and now I am like a light bulb. I am so happy that this came in the box. This is another really good product so yeah that was another really good one i guys i am super stoked with my ipsy glam bag plus so far the next product that i got is also a really cool product this is from naked cosmetics and inside of it there is um little mini pods of eyeshadows and look there's like one two three three, four, and the value of this is $40. So these are loose pigment shadows. This is like so cool. And each one of these look like they're like shimmery, like high impact kind of shadows. And this is really, really neat. And it's from Naked, another really good brand. Whether I'll keep it or put it in a giveaway. I don't know at this point, but I really think that this box was so good. Out of this box, I love this. I know this is a good product. I love this. Um, this seems like it might be a good product. I'm excited to try it. And this also seems like a fun product. I love that they're all like high impact shimmers. And I think this was a really, really, really good box. So my Ipsy Glam Bag Plus value was $151. I think that this was a fantastic starter box for me. This is my first box ever and I think it was amazing. I am so happy with it. Um, if I compare it to BoxyCharm now, um, in the BoxyCharm box, we had some good products, but now looking at this box, I feel like the Ipsy box was really, in my opinion, a lot better this month than BoxyCharm. BoxyCharm did give us this Butter London palette, which was really beautiful. It's still a gorgeous palette. I do like it, but if I were to pick between the two, I obviously would want the Huda Beauty one more. Um, we did get this really nice brush set from Luxie. This is a product that I really enjoyed as well, so this one was really nice. Um, we got a nice product from Ofra, which was this liquid lip. The only thing is the color is a little bit on the bright side 
for me. We did get this mud mask from Elemis, which is really nice as well. And then we also got a liner from a brand that I'm not really 100% sure of the brand, and I don't know where I put it. If I look at all the products together, in my opinion, I like the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus box more than I like the BoxyCharm box this month. I don't know, guys. Um, and this was the value of BoxyCharm, just so you guys can compare. Um, we got five beautiful full-size products in the G Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. I am really excited. I don't know. This is my first box. I don't know how the other boxes have been. I actually didn't even watch any videos before I ordered this box, so I got a really good first impression. If you guys are interested in Ipsy, I am going to put a link down below in the description box. If you guys are interested in signing up to Ipsy Glam Bag Plus, I will put a link down there. I love the products I got. I'm really happy with the box. So yeah, guys, that is my first time opening an Ipsy Glam Bag Plus and I love it. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Let me know what would you guys like down below for me to do during these unboxings. I think it would be fun to compare them to BoxyCharm and like have that be more of the main point. But let me know if you guys like that. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.